Hey people, this is probably going to be my second to last video, but this video is going to be about um, unboxing, spooling the reel that we're going to be unboxing. And yeah, this is the real D. Okuma Kavala. We're going to be opening it right now. Wait, I'm going to fix the film in a second. Yeah, let's fix it. Okay, this is the Okum Kabbalah. Put that aside. There is nothing in here. Okay, there's something in here. This is the real clamp with the screws. Okay, put this to the side. Okay. Now, um, this is the real. We're gonna see a first person view. Okay, the camera just failed. Okay, you're gonna see a first person view of holding this Okuma Cabal. If you're thinking about buying it, this has a lot of drag. It has exactly 15 pounds of drag or 24, 24 pounds of drag either one of those two if you want to have a good drag capacity or a good drag thing okay this reel has two speeds first this is low gear low gear is exactly 6.4 to 1 that's the gear ratio of up actually that's the gear ratio of up high Okay, now 6.4 to 1 is high. This is high when it's top. Okay, now let's go low. Let's press it in. Put this up. Like, switch it up if you want to go low. If you want to go low, press this. If you want to go high, push this. High, I mean low. High, low, high. Okay, now we're on low have to engage it before it spins properly it has a lot of drag I feel drag and exactly the low um, the low gear ratio has 6.8 to 1 gear ratio that's the gear ratio of low 6.4 to 1 is the gear ratio of high 3.8 3.8 to 1 is the gear ratio of low so high 6.4 low 3.81 okay now good things about this you have to press this you see this the black thing you have to press it then push this to have a lot more drag than normal and the like that peach feature and I'm gonna be using this for slow pitch jigging so the um, two speed the two speed is very handful I mean hand handy sometimes because slow jigging and blah 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 this is talking because my mom is in the room blah 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 again okay 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 guys cut that out cut that out then my mom just came in the room okay this is the clicker Pretty loud. Pretty loud. Now, normally these go up to um, 200 to 220 dollars US dollars. It's made in Taiwan. Made in Taiwan. Taiwan. Okay, Taiwan East. It's made in Taiwan. This is the Okuma brand. Okay, let's check the box again because I think it has a warranty uh, thing tag warranty tag okay, let's check the box again where is that son of a gun of a warranty tag there's nothing in there let's try to pull out the whole thing and where's the oh okay and where is the um the manual to how to take it down 
Oh, here these. Okay, first, let's check this one out. Take it to the side. Okay, what is this? Oh, it's the manual take down. Okay, how convenient. Okay, that's all of the spooky leaves. That's all the parts. The all the parts on this picture is numbered, so you're gonna check the numbering on this picture and check it here. So you know which part you need to replace. And then this other one is used to it's a it's a piece of paper to teach you how to properly take care of your reel but fishing reel oil on this one you need to not dunk the reel at all times wash it with um look I mean mid um mid mid warmth cold or either one you need to wash it you cannot submerge it anytime you can only like um Splash of water, not a really splash. Okay, don't put in the sun. Okay, but still, where's the tag? Oh, here's the tag. Okay, here's the tag. You found the tag. This is the Okuma tag. Okay, found the tag now. Let's keep going on the wheel. Okay, now I just I, I bought this from a Japan surplus store. I think it's the 2020 version. Don't know how to know if you guys know comment and this is the drag adjustment knob so you know how much drag you have yeah I normally have only a little bit of drag because my max line capacity of the I mean max line PE is the my rod is going to be pair up with PE 1.5 okay my brother just came in the room and yeah okay this is the drag adjustment knob this is the drag uh, lever this is the drag max drag button so you press that so it's thing okay now let's get to the other part okay let's pick a line to put on the reel okay where is there light yeah 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 light Okay, let's pick one. Okay, we need this one. We need that. We definitely need that. Now, so, uh, from all of these pools, okay, I'm gonna pick two. Okay. Oh, crap. Okay, I'm gonna pick two. Okay, let's put you on the thing. Blah, blah, brother. Now, which one should I pick? cheap one 500 meters meters I think it's 25 point 25 pounds uh, and the diameter is wait focus 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 I want to focus focus so shotgun I right, focus focus yeah 25 pounds, the diameter is 0 0.1, 0 0.20 millimeters, 500 meters, this is 4 strands, okay, okay, this is the cheap, cheap line, this is the more expensive line, it's like 3 times the price, okay, let's explain it, okay, super fishing line, pioneer fishing line, okay, this is eight strands and every 10 meters the color changes and it is PE 1.5 it breaks at 16.1 16.1 kilograms it is basically 30 pounds the diameter is 0 0.1 0 0.1 0 0.2 0 0.5 millimeters so 0 0.205 millimeters and we have 600 meters of line yeah that's the more expensive line 600 meters this is um, very expensive this one very cheap from China angry fish 
That's the brand. It's very bad. Now, okay, try not to buy this thing because it's four strands. But if you like four strands, just buy it if you want to because it's very cheap. It's like ten dollars. Ten dollars. So yeah, ten dollars. Okay, I'm gonna show you how I'm gonna film. Okay, this is how I'm gonna film. Kawaii. Guys, I think I packed too much line on the reel, but it was just trying to get the bang my buck for the, the bang for my buck. I don't know how that works. 
that's, I think that's too much line, but it's okay. But it's fine, okay. That concludes our line. That that actually fit, that fitted uh, 561 meters, which is a lot. I almost finished the whole spool. The whole spool was 600, so yeah. 561. Okay, that concludes our video. The rod that I used for this video is the Torzite XT Light Cast PE 1 to 2. It has all Fuji guides. And yeah, that's the whole video. Thank you. This is my whole spooling thing. It's my new spooling item. Thanks for watching and see you next time. Bye. Guys, whoever designed this freaking reel, whoever engineered it, is a smart ass guy or ga a gal. <laughs> because what they did is, okay, let's put the clicker on, put drag on. Shop. When you reel, you're just gonna hear the smallest sounds, not too noisy. But if you free spool it and you try to troll with the clicker on, it's gonna be a bit, a little bit louder. But if you just jig with it on, it's gonna be less louder. Cause they know that if we are fishing, we don't like loud clicking noise. But we need the 